All right, so we're in Anchorage. This is Flat Top Mountain. You can see in the background. I'll do my best. To see a little bit. That's where we're going. Uh, at least one of us is. Not sure if both of us will make it to the top. We will see. But uh, for now, there's the trailhead. The bathroom's here. And it was a long way up. But hopefully we'll see you at the top. Well, Holly has demanded almost immediately that I abandon her because she thinks that she will overdo it and try to keep up my pace getting to the top. But here's the view from where we're standing. I hope that comes through. It's just gorgeous. There's still snow on the mountain. There's still snow where I'm gonna be going up there somewhere, but that's the start. And I'm gonna head up and Next video will be either me tapping out or showing off some of the scenery. I wanted to take five seconds to show like how crazy and different this trail is from anything back home. I know these are firs. I don't know what they are. I can't find one with pine cones on it to figure out just exactly what it is. But I mean, here's, here's something you don't see on trails back home, not even on the AT, because no one's stupid enough to go on the AT when it looks like this, but. <laughs> I mean, come on, really? Uh, and the elevation gain here, this is a shout out to uh, some of my uh, trail buddies. Uh, I'm thinking about you, Relentless. I mean, this is nothing to you, because let's see, let's go to level ground, okay? And then look up. <laughs> this is the easy part. <laughs> Well, I'm making my approach to the mountain, and I can kind of see the trail zigzagging up of it. Let me give you an idea of the elevation gain. Level ground, the mountain. It's a lot. And at this moment, I'm doubting I can make it up it. But, like, I'm just thinking, you know, if I had my team here with me, any number of them, they would be way far ahead of me, and I'd be pushing myself to catch up with them. Um... And I keep thinking it's about like, you know, uh, what would what would um, late bloomer be saying? She'd be up, you know, quarter mile up the trail, saying, you know, come on, wrong way, get your ass moving, or you can do it, or something motivating like that. So I'm gonna need that in about an hour. <laughs> Holy cow! Holy shit! I, I quote a fine hiker who said. Don't tell me about my contractions. <laughs> I mean, let's see if I can switch. Oh, I can't switch around. I'll switch you. I'll take a pause, catch some breath. The heart rate, like, oh, it's actually pretty decent. So we're climbing the mountain. I know, pretty dumb. Pretty dumb. I think the last video I made, I was over there. So somewhere on that trail over there. So some steps. So... Don't tell me about my contractions. <laughs> well, as usual, video is not going to do it any justice. But this was, if not one of the most, the sickest vertical staircase I've ever been on. I can't even call it a staircase. At some point, the stairs were flattened, kind of, and you were just grabbing handholds to get up them. You could see the people way down there. I don't know if I'll be able to zoom or not. Maybe you could see them. They're three levels down, so this goes all the way over there, up again. Oh, oh great, now I'm getting rained on. <laughs> and this is the worst of it right here. This part right here was awful terrible. Oh, God. Why am I doing this? <laughs> all right. When I get this on video, I won't see if you can see the people up there hiking. Okay. That is a straight vertical hike from horizontal here, so... This is, these are the switchbacks. The top is up there somewhere. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna have to keep telling myself I'm only gonna be here once, maybe, in a lifetime. But, I mean, I'm halfway right now. I'm not feeling it. I looked at my, uh, my Fitbit and I've gone 120 something flights of stairs. <laughs> I don't train like that. But we'll see. This is the type of hiking we're doing really slow through rocks and basically sheer cliff faces that go 
I don't know if I can get to see it, but straight to the point of your death. Well, I can at least see the flag, but this has been like really bad. Um, it's hard to, there's no trail markers. You're only kind of going where you see people at, and there's, maybe you can see down there, there's where I stopped and sat before. I mean, this is pure craziness. Like, turn the camera around. I keep asking myself, like, why am I doing this? And I keep telling myself the same thing. When's the next time I'm gonna be on Flat Top Mountain? Might as well have it scare the shit out of me, make me fear for my life, and um, enjoy hiking. <laughs> Uh, happy trails. Well, I just asked these two mountain goats if this was the way. They informed me there is no way. Just climb up the rocks. Right. <laughs> Again, why am I doing this? Let's, let's, let's give it a... All right, I made it. And it was not due to my own help. It was due to the help of those two young men and their dog. I don't know if you can see them out in the distance. They talked me up most of it because um, I got terrified uh, about a quarter mile from the top and uh, I don't think I would have made it if it wasn't for these uh, two locals who got me up the mountain. So uh, thank you for uh, Avi and Matt, wherever you are, maybe you'll see this channel someday. I don't know, backpackers on a family channel. But anyway, you can see there's the flag, we made it. I'll try to get a selfie with that, but uh, just turn around and look at this. Well, we'll try this again. I'm not sure what happened on that one. Uh, we're up here. I made it to the top. I don't know if you can see the flag behind me. Um, I made it. It was, uh, I got the help from a couple of locals who were hiking this. They said for the like umpteenth time, Matt and Avi, if you, if you ever watch this video, thank you, appreciate it. Uh, I was literally hugging a rock on the side of the mountain. And I was like, hey, have you guys done this before? And they're like, oh yeah, all the time, follow us. <laughs> and these two guys half my age sprinted up the mountain and I kept in tow and I did not let them get too far from me. So here we go again with the view. It is crazy. Yeah, the mountain is flat up here. I mean, this is like, it's, it's, it's gorgeous. Uh, the view is incredible. Um, I don't know how the fuck I'm gonna get back down this mountain. <laughs> it is, it is, uh, this is, this is the scariest hike I've ever done. I won't lie, I've done a lot of hikes in the last four years since I started this, but this is the scariest one. Sheer rock face. Uh, uh over and out. <laughs> maybe I'll see at the bottom. Maybe, uh, other stuff will happen. <laughs> flat top rock, or flat top mountain. Well, halfway down. Uh, I can't tell you that going down was any better than going up. It was actually a lot scarier. And actually, I got, I got lost over on the other side of that mountain. Going down, all of a sudden I looked down below me and all it was is glaciers. And I'm like, uh, I don't think I rode glaciers up. <laughs> so I had to look where all the humans were, co were at and, and back down here, right down, downhill humans. Uh, so yeah, uh, here's level. No, let me see. Here we go. Here's level. There's what we're doing. Hope that helps. So heading back down after me that video, you know, whenever you climb a mountain and you're on the other side of it and you look up, holy shit, the flag is way up there. Look at that. Let's zoom in. Where are you flag? Way up there. Maybe you could see it. I don't know. But whenever you're on the other side of the mountain, there's always a sense of holy shit. I did that. Wow, I'm dumb. <laughs> so now we're heading back. Nice flats. Uh, to tell you the truth, I was swinging around. The way down was so much worse than up. Up was just kind of clenching balls and climbing up rocks, which this is, was not a trail. This was a, this was a rock climb. Um, Flat Top Mountain's definitely mostly a rock climb. There's a lot of this. There's a lot of walking mountain flats, but uh, that was a climb. And the way down, uh, I'll admit it fully, you know, I slid on my butt in a couple places, and I'm proud of that. 